guys, Cindy out of here with my Arts Endeavors. How are we doing today? I'm doing pretty well. Look at our big fat book, our ABC book. It's getting really, really, really thick, but that's okay. Um, today we are here to, what are we doing? We have WX. <laughs> we are on the X, and then we have Y and Z, and we will be done. Amazing, amazing journey on this. All right, so we have X. Hmm. What are we going to do with our X? I'm in the mood for blue, so I'm going to take a little bit of this teal. I'm going to take a little bit of the white, and we're going to mush it around. That's the first thing we're going to do. All right, so I sat here and I racked my brain about words that I could come up with for an X for um, chronic pain. And I probably am not going to say this word right, but I think you guys will get the gist. The only thing I could come up with is, ex how do you say it, honey? Explicative? Like when you say bad words. Explicit. Explicit? Is that it? No. No. E X P L E T I V E. Explicit. I can't. <laughs> I can't say the word. Okay. Pause the camera. <laughs> Boss man says pause the camera. I'll be back. <laughs> All right. So I got my trusty Google out <laughs> or Siri. This is the word. Explicative. E X P L E T I V E. And it's basically when you say an oath or a swear word. So like when you're in really bad pain and you're like, bah, 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 that's the word I was thinking of. <laughs> so that's the word we're using today. Um, and that honestly is the only bad word I could think of to come up with for chronic pain with an X. And that doesn't even start with an X. So yeah, there you have it. And what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to put a little bit of, um, I'm going to take a little bit of this blue. And I just want to do a few of these little guys. And here comes my cat again. Really, Abadu, you can't. She thinks she can sit on the desk while I play and paint. And then she ends up, I end up with little teal or purple or green footprints all over. Oops. That was still wet. Look at that, took the paper right off. And so she's sitting over here on my side. Pucky Dog is sleeping. Well, maybe sleeping. And yeah. All right. So yeah, explicative, <laughs> however you say it, was the word that I was at. So that's what we're going to put on this card. I just have to get it painted. So give me a second. I'm gonna, whoops. I'm going to dry this up. And then we're going to get that word put on this card. So I don't have to try to say it again. And I will be right back. All right. So I took my Sharpie and I just went around the outside again like I normally do. Um, these are just pieces of a dictionary page. Sometimes at night I'll sit, um, if I'm watching a movie and I'll just do some doodles and then I color them in and that's exactly what these are. So I just thought maybe I would put some of these on here just because I can. Why not? Right? Put one there. Let's put this one here. Not in any particular order. I'm just putting them down wherever I think they'd look cool. I'll put this one right here. How's that? All right. I like that. All right. Now I want to take a... First I just took a baby wipe. wipe. Whoops. Get back here. Stay there. You're supposed to stay there glued. And then I'm going to take a Stabilo pencil and we're going to go around those. Oh, and let me find my pencil. All right. So yeah, that was the only word that I could think of. Um, 
when it comes to the chronic pain pain you know we have things like x-rays and you know things that sound like x like exam and that kind of stuff but this is the only one I could really um, think that I wanted to put on here and if you come up with a word an x word that goes with chronic pain let me know in the comments below I'd love to know what it is <laughs> because like I said it was just I was like huh what am I going to use for a word so we got creative and um, you know I know we've all been there we've all thought bad words if not said bad words and hey you know it's okay we're allowed to uh, you know get ornery at times right okay so now I want to put the word on here um, I got out these stickers just because they're easy and I think I'm gonna go with the black maybe if they'll come off yes I'm gonna put it right here E X black right here P L E T I V E. So where's my L? L E. Hope I have room. I don't think I might have room. E. I like the way it's going on. I V E. So here's my I. Here's my V. And I need one more E. Am I going to get it? Let's see. crazy word right but hey it's all good there it is now I want to take just throw some dots on here just because we can Sorry guys, I'm being quiet. I'm just thinking. Can you guys see the smoke? All right. Call the fire company. Don't we have a fire hydrant out front? I don't know if we do. I don't think we do. All right, there it is. There's our backside. I kind of like it. I like the way it goes. <laughs> All right, let's do our front side. Now, our front side, again, we talk about words, right? So, the only one I could come up with on the front side was examine. And the reason I said examine is because, you know, sometimes you really have to look at what you're doing that's causing the pain and then you have to learn how to do it differently um, that doesn't mean that you can't do it that doesn't mean that you know you should stop doing whatever it is that's causing the pain that just means you got to look at a different way of doing it so let's paint up this side what is that and again, I'm doing it with this teal and this white just because it's out here and that's what I felt like playing with. I actually want to do this one a little bit more white. So yeah, that's really all you can do is, you know, examine what's happening. Why are you hurting the way you are? What's causing it? And what can I do different? And sometimes that's the hardest thing to do because you just, you know, you're so used to being in that 
um, in that the ability to do whatever you want to do. Daisy, you're supposed to be sleeping. Pucky's awake. Don't ask me why I call her Pucky, but I do. She's my Pucky dog. All right. So we've got this painted. Let me dry this up, and I'll be right back. So well, I've got my paint dry, and I've got some washi out here that I just want to play around with because I'm not going to put too much texture on this one. Just going to play. So yeah, we were talking about examining and really that's my best piece of advice is to, you know, if you do something and it causes pain um, and it's something you enjoy doing and something you want to continue doing, then you're just going to have to figure out a different way to do it. Um, one of the things that my husband and I have, you know, figured out is if I want to go to like a festival or if I want to go to actually a couple last weekend, we went to a, a, a craft show. Well, I had a choice. I either had to take my scooter, which would have been a pain in the butt to get around in there, or, um, you know, we, I had to use the wheelchair. And at this point, as long as I'm having fun, um, I don't care. So we use the wheelchair and hubs push me around. So that's when I talk about examining uh, how you do things and what causes pain and how you can change it so that you still can do the things you enjoy doing yet, um, you know, try to stay as relatively as pain free as possible. So that's what I mean. Now, um, I just used a little bit of washi and of course I'm darkening the edges and then I've got these little flowers right here and again at night um, if I sit and watch television or a movie or whatever I will sit with a dictionary and doodle um, sometimes not all the time but I have these little flowers here and I just I love them I love how they turned out so I kind of want to put them up along this somehow uh, and I should have used a piece of washi. Let's try something different. Let's put them. Pucky, lay down. Whoops, hold on, guys. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these flowers, and I want to glue them. I have this idea. Let's see if it works. Put one right here. Pucky Dog's talking to Daddy. She wants to get down, but she hasn't taken a nap yet. She's been up all day long. Alright, so I'm going to put those three just like that. And then I'm going to take another piece of this washi. Let's see if this works. Oh, she's crying. You're crying. She will survive. She's not being abused. She's just upset. Let me put it right there. And then cut off the excess. And let's see what it does. Yeah, that's cute. And then I want examine right here. So I'm going to find some letters to put examine and I will be right back. So we have our word examine here. So I'm going to glue them down onto here. Let's see, X, A, M. Make sure I have enough room this time so I don't run out. So we're going to move this one up a little bit. So here's my E. X. Yeah, so like I said, you know, take a look at ways that you're doing things that causes pain. 
see what you can do to change the way of doing that thing that you're doing and um, you know work with it it doesn't doesn't happen overnight you don't figure everything out you know the first time some things work some things don't so just take your time and figure out what those things are and you're gonna find out life gets a lot easier I like this one all right so I'm just gonna add a little few dots here and there and like I said, they, they are not words that begin with X, but they were the closest that I could think of to, um, you know, create a tag and, and discuss chronic pain. All right, let me grab, I got to get some fibers. Let's see, what do we want today? Let's do some sparkles. I've got this sparkly ribbon and we're going to use that. Actually, I wonder if I should, that's all right, we'll cut it off. I'll use the spare pieces. Okay, there we go. Another tag for our um, ABCs of chronic pain. On our back side, we have our explicative, which is um, to, it's a noun and it's to yell or to curse or to say bad words. And that looks kind of funny going down like that, but that's all good. I can handle that. And then on the front side, we have examine. And again, examine, you know, what's causing the pain? What can you do to change it? and go from there all right as always i hope you guys have enjoyed uh, don't forget to like comment share and subscribe leave me a comment if you have any questions or um, whatever in the in the description box below and i will go ahead and answer them for you so as always have fun that's what life's all about happy creating i'll talk to you guys soon Bye bye